Well, Caroline, I fucked up and told her. Turns out, the hurt I tried to spare was mine, not hers. Oh, Shimshin. You should really take it easy, Ingele. I like to stick knife in the side of Nazi's stomach, just slightly to the right above the pelvis. Then, twist knife to destroy their insides. Doesn't feel too good, I can tell. You like the approach, lady. And why that place specifically? I learned this when I was a child, and surgeon had to cut out my fingers. How are you, Captain? Sometimes I think of Cosmo, my dog in Italy. I miss Cosmo. I miss my home. Write a writing letters or some matter. Ah, this is a love letter. Hey. No, 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 it's not a fucking love letter. It's a performance review letter for one of the crew members. Huh. Who? Maria works at the fuel hangar depot. Good lass. Okay. So you write like this. Maria, your blue eyes are like. The ocean. Shut it, yes. Brown eyes, not blue. Oh. You have performed your tasks admirably. And I salute your... <laughs> passion. Spirit. Passion. Then you write, Now I would like to admire your blue eyes over some dinner. Right, Max? <laughs> They're brown, you tosser. Yes, yes. How you doing? <clears throat> Congratulations, Vegas. Wow. These graphics sure are realistic. Feel like I'm inside the game.
Hello, Captain. Just appalling what happened to Manhattan. An open wound on the American soul that will never heal. Ow! Fergus put rocks in there or something? <laughs> How's it going? What is this you doing? I can't find any peanut butter, so I'm not really in a good mood right now. Mm. I was simply wondering if you would like to do something together later. What? I don't know. Mm. Recreational activity of some kind. Listen. And listen to me carefully, Sigrun. I've looked through your records. Lists upon lists of atrocities. The Yosemite Massacre, burning of the Baltimore Ghetto, Nashville. Stop! I was just following my mother. I, no, I am not responsible. I did not commit any of those acts myself. Oh, if you don't trust me, then why don't you just kill me right now? <laughs> but you are there. You stood by and watched it all happen. And you did nothing to stop your mother. She would have sought me weak. An embarrassment. I just... What? I just wanted her to be pleased with me. Oh. Oh, I'm nauseous now. And I don't know if it's the pregnancy or you. Hello there. <laughs> Hello, Blaskowitz. Yes, hello, Captain. Long day, Blasco. Seem to be getting longer and longer. Oh, Captain Blaskowitz. You're happy now, Peg.
Hey, Captain. Sometimes I think about Manhattan. Shit that went down there. Just drains me of all hope. Hello. Hello, ciao. Hey, man. My friend. Good to see you. Blasco What's up, man? Good to see you again. Goodbye. Back during the war, my plane went down somewhere in the French Alps. Five years of my life just vanished. Amnesia of the mind. Nasty television sure is duller than a Dundee doorknob. Somebody needs to stop these. Captain, very refreshing. With new people on the ship, they have such stories to tell. Greetings. Sir?
feels like I'm been entombed. We're safe, Barbara. That's what matters. Don't you worry. It reminds me of when the bomb fell. Being deep underground, trapped. Right. Let's see if this bird is ready to fly like Grace asked me to. Put everything else out of your mind. A letter from the wing commander. Merci, Mr. Blaskovitz. Looks like I need more power. The heat from the first wave and the screams. Fucking screams, man. Bonjour. Chopper's fat and sassy. Should let Grace know. Good to see you, brother. Hello. Captain. All right. Good to go. Thanks, man. Mm. I think it's time we had a gathering. Uh, Max, what have you done? This is no good. What's going on? Oh shit! Here he comes. What are you sure not looking up? For Christ's sake! Why wasn't anyone watching it? Uh, Fargus, everyone is busy. No time for babysitting. Well, lock him up with a pig, then. What's the problem? <laughs> Mentors. My favorite shirt. Fuck, Max. <laughs> Fergus, it's only a shirt. No, it's not just a fucking shirt. I got this shirt at Kinloss. It's the only one I have. All right, y'all. Drop whatever the fuck you're doing. Because we got some hell to raise. Hey, Englishman, you got nukes on this ship, did you know that? Oh, is that why it only took one of them to level Death's Head's entire fucking compound? How'd you figure that out, oh great genius? Oh, so you knew, yet you only used the one. Explain that blip to me, shit for brains, because you are stupid for real. Oh, for fuck's sakes, you can't bloody well just go around dropping bombs on random civilians, you dim-witted bombard. Oh, eat me, cocksucker, I'm not saying we chunk nukes at a bunch of cities all willy-nilly, pencil dick. Do I look like a fucking Nazi to you? No, 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 no. I would say you most resemble a skitterdrukit cunt rag, emitting a heinous honking similar to that of a shite spoon volcano, affronting the senses at full force. Well, at least my face isn't a dead ringer for a massive prolapsed rectum. I want to blow a gut just looking at your bleary eyed jive ass. You know what I'm saying? The reason. We haven't used one of the other atom bombs, which would be obvious to anyone who isn't profoundly idiotic as we need a proper target first. Well, I'm here to say that I got a proper target. And it's a fucking good one, too. So sit your clown ass down, you dumb fuck Scottish motherfucker. Fair enough. 
Check it out. I sent Speci ahead to his hometown of Roswell, New Mexico to prep for the mission. Now, there's a tunnel that's accessible through Speci's hideout that will take you straight into the Nazis' top secret underground base where they're experimenting with some sort of wigged out alien technology. Roswell, New Mexico, you said? This is one of ours. What do you mean? One of yours? Yeah, wouldn't you like to know? So you can send coded messages back to your pals in Berlin? No! What the fuck is she even doing here? Grace, why? She's good people. She's a fucking Nazi. On your boat. What were you saying, Pops? Hmm? Hmm. That secret base you were talking about was constructed by us. That's you. One of our biggest safe keeps. Yeah, it was located here, underground, near what is now Roswell, New Mexico, but it, it existed for a thousand years, long before America got subjugated by the Europeans. It contained technology related to anti-gravity research, something that could easily turn the tide of war. We gave the U.S. government access to it. Unfortunately, it was too late. America fell. The Nazis took hold of our safekeeping. Shit, that's not gonna sit well with Speci. He had his bet on space aliens. He once saw a ship that crashed back there in 47. So what do you want with this place? Know what the Oberkommando is? Hey, that's where the top brass clog tails of the Nazi war machine reside. Yeah, well, the Nazis moved it into your safe keep set. So whatever it is is so important that the whole upper echelon of the Nazi leadership left Berlin and set up shop in New Mexico. And this is why you need this for. What on earth is that? This is a portable nuclear bomb. We're gonna take out the Oberkommando, cripple the Nazi leadership, and destabilize the fucking country and let the people know that the fight is back on. Blazkowicz, load up. I'm sending you to Roswell with this. Roswell is out of helicopter range, so we'll drop you off by the coast near Galveston. From there, you will catch a ride to Roswell. Rendezvous with Super Special at Papa Joe's All-American Diner and plant the nuke inside the very heart of the Oberkommando. Then, you blow that shit the fuck up.